Well, you join us here live from Hafnefjordur for Iceland cricket's first axe throwing competition. Lee Nelson of Hafnefjordur to throw first in the final. Three points for the red ring, which Lakmal Bandara of Reykjavik has equaled for the first throw. Each of these players will throw five times. And that's five points for Nelson. And five points, the bullseye from Bandara. Nothing to separate these two players in this exciting decider. Another five. Oh dear. And Bandara has bounced out. Her early pressure of performance from Nelson has told on Bandara. Without remorse, another five. Oh dear. And Bandara has bounced out again. And it's all going Hapnefjordur's way in this early stage of the final. A seven and a nothing. Well, what a performance in this first of the four pairings in the final. Look at the lead that Nelson has opened up there for Habnefjordur. And it's going to take some coming back for Reykjavik. Four pairings, each throwing five times. The international coronavirus pandemic has called off the European Cricket Series tournament. And having dispatched Kolpavor in the axe throwing, it's these two teams. Fernando, a frisky throw. Oh, well, Robertson a bounce out there, so that's uh, moved the momentum a little bit towards Reykjavik and another rapid throw from Fernando. That matched with a solid three from Robertson of Hapnefjordr to maintain that substantial lead for the team in green. Another solid three. But, uh, Robertson's throw is very gentle. He's not putting as much beef into it as this Sri Lankan wicketkeeper is. Just the one this time from Fernando, but a bounce out from Robertson. Well, he works with Wood. Maybe he just respects Wood too much to be able to damage it in the brutal way that Fernando is doing. Three more. And nothing from that rather mincing throw from Robertson. And uh, well, although Fernando has come back well there, the Hapnefjordur lead is still intact at the halfway stage. And deciding to throw third of the four pairings because they haven't got the guts to throw last are the two team captains. Lanka Tilika of Reykjavik throws a three. He's claiming it's a five, but Yunus <laughs> suggests otherwise. And Yunus of Hapnefjordur, their captain, throws a three as well. He's saying to the referee, well, how can he possibly claim that's a five? And those are better throws, aren't they? These two captains, well, they may not have the bottle to throw last. Lanka Dilika arguing that Eunice's axe fell out, but the adjudicator has allowed that to stand. Rather wayward throws at the moment. Oh dear, there, no, that's not going to work for Hapnefjordr. And they're just opening the door a little for Reykjavik to let them back in. Hapnefjordr clinging onto the lead. Solid three from the Reykjavik captain. Solid three from the Hapnefjordr captain. But if this isn't more exciting than cricket, I don't know what is, frankly. A good throw from Lankatilika, putting the pressure on Eunice to maintain the Hapnefjord the lead. But he's got his solid three in there. And as we move now to the final pairing, this is an interesting matchup. The most experienced player in the tournament, Samuel Gill, 
been playing cricket in Iceland for 20 years and he's the chairman of the Icelandic Cricket Association and facing him is the newest player, Max Sandaru of Reykjavik. And they've both scored threes with the first of their five throws. The veteran saying to the youngster, anything you can do, I can match. Pressure's back on Sandaru. Three for him. Gill. Three also. Every time Reykjavik equalize, Abnehirtur just get their noses ahead. Gill, a very experienced campaigner. Three from Sandaru. Three from Gill. Tension almost unbearable here. I think I might be sick. I'm not really going to be sick. Of course, I'm a professional. Sandaru, again. Five. That's made it interesting. Pressure on Gill. Oh, shit. It's fallen on the floor. How embarrassing. And Reykjavik, for the first time, have their noses in front. Just ahead. Oh, good God. Sandaru has spilled one. Three to win, then three. And it's just a one. Would you believe it? Reykjavik, at the last gasp, have triumphed. What a game. What a win. I need to lie down.